What's up guys and welcome back to some more Amanda the Adventurer. As you guys know in the last video, we got the good and the bad ending for the game and we blew up the TV with a brick. But I'm pretty sure Amanda escaped into the real world. But we're going back in today because we have some secrets and some horrifying things to find in this video. Apparently there's these hidden tapes all throughout the attic and I think there's six of them in total and we're gonna find all of them in today's video and see what they have in store for us. It's gonna be a very exciting video so be sure to stay tuned all the way to the end of the video if you guys wanna see some hidden lore in this game and apparently some very dark things. Anyways, let's Let's go ahead and press continue and hop back in to Amanda the Adventurer. All right, so I'm wondering where this is going to start us. I'm assuming on the final tape where we can type in guts into the box, right? Let's see. Yep, there's the box right there. Okay, so yeah. All right, all right, this is good. So apparently there's a few different tapes that we can find. One of them involves putting a plant over there and watering it until we can put a flower on her and then she gives us the tape. But the one we're going to be getting first is this one right here. So there's a peach back here, which I mean, it's pretty obvious this is something, right? You know, it's a hidden peach behind the, the boxes over there. It's got to be something. And uh, if we take it over here, right, and we just make a pie with it, it. So I actually need to find a pan though. Uh oh, <laughs> there's no pan anywhere. Oh no, I, I don't have a pan. How am I supposed to cook this with no pan? All right, so it looks like this is going to be a little bit more difficult than I initially thought, but we actually have to start a new game and there's a few things that we have to do. So step one, you have to go back here, grab this with the number four on it. You have to take it over here and put it under this to water it, just like I was saying earlier. So each day though, we have to bring this back here, make sure it gets water and continues to grow. So that's how we're going to get the flower for her right there and she's going to give us a tape. But for the one that we're going to be getting right now, we actually need to continue the game like normal, start up the, you know, the tapes and stuff like that. Wait until this thing is right here and put a peach inside a tin and then cook it into a pie. All right, guys, so I just finished the first tape and we need to get that uh, that skip button for sure for, you know, to skip things along. But look, I, I lost all my stickers. All my endings are gone. <laughs> it's soiled. They soiled and it's gone. Okay, anyways, back to this. All right, so we need to put the peach in the pan, put it in there and make it into a pie. It's Wooly's favorite pie. It makes sense. Let's see what we get out of this, though. I'm excited. I love this kind of stuff, though, man. It's always fun when you can, like, go back and play the game again and get something new. All right, that was quick. Okay, hey, I got an achievement. Not that pie. What was that a... Anyone else just see that mosquito, or was that in real life? I don't know. All right, give me this. What is it? It's blank, of course. All right, let's give it a watch and see uh, what it has in store for us. I don't have my popcorn, Where's though, but I wish I did. Where's the birthday girl? Usually my mom holds my cake. Oh. Well, come on, Lauren. We have a special surprise for you. Okay. Here's oh, what I no. Have. We know what this is. <laughs> Who's ready for ice cream and cake? She's busy with her best friend. Hey, nice mustache. It's like she didn't even hear me. And we need to talk about some new TV rules. <laughs> Unplug the you know TV. What, Let me try. I, I want to I capture the big surprise on video. <laughs> Lauren, honey, we got cake and ice cream. We got your favorite, mint chocolate chip. Come on, baby. Ooh, we can watch Amanda another time. Actually it's awful. So <laughs> Lauren? Everything okay? Oh. Oh, she ran away. Lauren? Mm, Lauren? I love mint chocolate oh. chip. Ooh, Amanda. Okay, that's your first sign. Yep, that's your first sign to get out of the house, blow it up, run far away. As soon as she says, oh my, she was listening to them. She literally said, I love mint chocolate chip. Oh, that's creepy. Okay, well, that's not good. So, all right, let, let's... Uh, whew. All right, so that means... So the little girl was watching the TV, right? Obviously, she's getting in like a trance by Amanda and stuff like that. And then I guess Amanda must have told her to run away or something like that. She was gone. She ran out of there. Or it made it seem like that. Maybe Amanda can like control things in the real world and she's like opened the door to make it seem like she ran away, but she actually didn't. And she like absorbed her into the TV. I don't know, but that is very interesting. All right, let's continue on to the next one. All right, guys, here we are with the next oh, no. secret tape. So we need to go to this part and type in some very specific things. So, well, he's gotten in an accident. Yep. Fault. Yeah, nobody's at fault at all. Couldn't be yours, Amanda. Your yeah, it totally wasn't you. Uh huh. Get hurt almost everywhere. Oh, okay. At the creepy little side head that she gave us right there. Afternoon, we Tilted were her playing, head. and Wooly tripped and fell. Okay. I, I didn't so, swear on Wooly. Does it look like right he here? Hurt? We need to type in knee. Okay, you have That's to. That's right. And then Wooly hurt his knee. Okay, so this is normal. Who can help when you are hurting? Now this is important. Okay, here you need to type in nobody. Apparently, You're oh, we got the achievement. Right. The sad truth. Let's take Wooly to the hospital okay. to see a doctor. So, hmm, which room I'm gonna pause it go here. Into the since we got, hold on, hold on. Before we continue, we got the achievement. So I'm assuming 
The tape is somewhere around. Oh, wait, is that new? A blue tape. This has to be new. We got the next one. All right. So can I put it in right now or do I have to watch this? I have to watch this. Okay. So let's get through this quickly. I need a doctor to help Wooly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got to take him here then. Come on. Let's, let's get, get Wooly, Wooly fixed, up. fixed up. Yep. Oh, look at the time right there too. We're of course going to need that for later on. But really hurts. And that one too. So, all right. I'm going to skip past all this though and let's, let's put that tape in. Just help. finished the episode. Completed it. It should take us out of here now, and I should be able to put in a new tape, which is pretty exciting. I want to know what's on these, man. These have some very interesting secrets. Ah, the Hamlin. Follow us to fun. Uh-huh. Definitely will. Okay, so that's out. And this goes in. And let's see. I'm so excited. It's going to be crazy. Okay, what do you got? What is this? Oh. An interrogation room? 3 8 2002 2 47 p.m. Oh, wait, is that the little girl that was watching the show? I don't know. I didn't pay close attention to her, but I think that is her. Or this could be another victim. Okay, so it looks like we have no audio. That's on purpose. So they're interrogating her about. I'm assuming she went to them or the parents, you know, she went to her parents and said, I've been talking to the girl on the TV, or the girl on the TV's been telling me to do this and that. And they, uh, they took her here to get maybe evaluated. I don't know if this is like a mental check or checkup or if this is like a investigation like she killed someone. But I'm assuming it's more of like a mental checkup, maybe? I have no idea. But it seems like, uh, oh, she's signing something. Or is she drawing? What? No, it looks like she's signing? Yeah, she signed that. Hmm. What is going on here? Unless those are like the show producers or something like that and they're getting her to sign like an NDA or whatever it's called. I, I don't know. That is interesting though. I'm going to need all, you, all of your uh, theories in the comment section down below, but... Oh, I think that's the end of that one. Oh no, there's more. Okay. Hmm. Security guard. What's he guarding? They're putting her back in... What? So is she like an experiment? I don't know. Where are they taking her? What's in there? What is that? I think they're gonna have her watch the show again. I don't I don't know. I have no idea. That is very intriguing. Huh. I need a map pad for this one, because that is very intriguing. I wanna continue though for sure. Okay, so our plant though, how's this coming along? Doesn't look like it's fully done yet. We're gonna keep that growing. And I've got more tapes to find. So we have two so far, and I need four more we know there's one there i need three other ones so i'm gonna keep looking though and uh, uh you guys will see as soon as i find the next tape all right guys here we are with the second or whatever the third tape whatever i still on the third uh this has been taking me quite a while so but uh okay so this is the main tape that we need to be on for this one so we need to go to the 24 7 store as you guys remember in our playthrough we saw a bunch of musical notes on the back wall of this store and apparently if we take those musical notes pause it here and we go put them Nate, into the actual piano thingy. We unlock another tape. So we're going to try that out here. But first, we got to get past this go part. Okay, so yep, you go to the store to buy them a card, Do you of course. Know where the store yes, is? of course I know where the store is. It's right Good there. Job. Yeah, we're no problem. The All right, let's, let's go. All right, pause it. So there we go. We've got these notes right here. So uh, I don't know if uh, this is going to be easy or not. Yeah, I don't know what. <laughs> How the heck? I've never played piano. I don't know how this works. I'm going to go with um one, two. Uh, okay, so it's like down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down. I don't think this is going to work, but we can give it a shot. Um, Down, down, up, down, up, down. <laughs> how the heck do you play a piano? What do I look like? And we're in. I got another tape. All right, so we got the red one. So let's go ahead and put this in. I got an achievement, Beethoven. Yeah, that's what they called me in high school. Let's go ahead and uh, put this bad boy. Okay, hello? Oh, I got to finish this. <laughs> I got too excited. All right, fine, I'll finish this. All right, so I just finished that tape. Let's grab this red one and put it in and give it a watch. Here we go. It's been three weeks since local oh, television producer Sam is. Colton was reported missing, and authorities still have no leads. Colton is the creator of Amanda the Adventurer, the public access children's educational program that became a huge hit among area children. But with Colton's disappearance, the future of the show remains unclear. 
Last year, Hamlin Entertainment purchased rights to the live-action program starring Colton's daughter Rebecca. Oh, no. As budget and production value increased, Hamlin reimagined the show as an animated series, planning to syndicate the program nationally. Hamlin's acquisition of the program and Colton's recent disappearance have raised some eyebrows. And to further fuel these concerns, new episodes of Amanda the Adventurer have had subject matter that has left local parents uncomfortable about the program. Wait, My so... kids are still really into that show, but it has changed. I mean, I walked in the other day and Amanda was talking about how mommies and daddies aren't always right. I mean, what is that? That's not something you tell impressionable mm. kids. I had to change the channel. I just told the kids that the TV was acting up. It's not yet clear yeah, how lucky. Colton's disappearance will affect the involvement of his daughter, Rebecca, the show's young star. We reached out to Hamlin Entertainment for an interview. While representatives declined to comment, they did release a written statement. We at Hamlin have concerns surrounding the nature of Sam Colton's abandonment of both our program and his daughter. We cannot speculate on his reasons for leaving. We do ask that the community respect the privacy yeah, of Rebecca Colton as she needs time out of the spotlight to process these disturbing events. For the time being, Rebecca's local appearances have been canceled, including the Kensdale Public Library fundraiser, Woolies Readathon, this Saturday evening. Rest assured that Amanda is not going anywhere. Hamlin Entertainment remains committed to our vision for this cherished program. Hmm. Despite this statement, authorities have not drawn any conclusions about the nature of Sam Colton's disappearance. We will share any future updates as the story develops. When we return, we'll check in with Zappo, the talking gerbil. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. So, okay, so Sam disappeared. It's Amanda's me, your friend, Skip. And with me, as always, is my trusty dog, Chip. Oh, yeah. Skip and Chip. Okay. <laughs> Just threw that in there. All right, well then, that was some interesting lore. Very interesting lore. How's our plant doing, by the way? I don't know if it's ready or not. I don't think it is. So I'm gonna let it keep growing, but we need more tapes. All right, so here's how we get the next tape. So apparently we have to get the... What's a family tape, which we have in our hands right now. We need to pop it in here and go to the part where she asks a specific question and put in the word Sam or the name Sam, which uh, apparently Hi causes friend. things to go bad. All right, so we're going to see the chickens right now. Chicken. And apparently what this is where, bad. yep, things go having bad. Okay, so nice. having a family, look at all the I chickens in the background like glitching around, look at them. They're like chicken. glitching out. What's that and one, by the way? Me. What's on that one's head? I see Looks weird. Chicken. Oh yeah, there look they are. The oh, look Do at them. The oh yeah, I, I have a feeling it might be Sam. Oh. What did you say? An achievement. You... Yep. We go? So let's pause. And apparently, yep, there's another tape. We got the green one. All right. So the daddy chicken is called Sam. Very interesting. Okay, so let's finish watching this one and pop in the green tape after. Nah. So I just finished that tape. The green one is going in now. Let's see, I'm excited, man. These are cool. These are like lore videos. I get the cursor out of the way and let's see. Come on, show me something crazy. Oh, coffee break with Sadie Cabin. She ain't Cabin. Welcome to Coffee Break. Today I'm talking with Sam Colton, the creator oh. of the hit kids show Amanda the Adventurer. And I have to say, a fantastic missing. studio neighbor. Thanks for having me on the show, Sadie. You're a pretty good studio neighbor yourself. Though, I am going to gain 50 pounds if you keep stocking the kitchen with those delicious homemade cookies. You can't have a coffee break without cookies. <laughs> Sam, last year you started producing Amanda the Adventurer right here in the studio. The whole town loves it. Did you even imagine that would be such a big sensation? Honestly, Sadie, no. <laughs> it was a total surprise. I mean, it's scrappy at best. You know how it is when you have a big idea and a little budget. I don't know if I know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Kids don't really care about that, though. They see the heart. And boy, does your show have a big heart. You know, I really have to thank our local librarian, Miss Kate, for being such a champion of the project. I think she's talked about it at every single story time. I think it's just so rare nowadays for kids' shows to be so much fun, but also really teach kids something, isn't it? Mm. What inspired you to create Those Amanda? mugs are definitely empty. I wanted to create a show that teaches children that our world is a magical place. 
that there are little adventures waiting around every corner in their very own neighborhood. The show is a celebration of kids' imaginations. Mm. But really, it's all Rebecca. As soon as I met my beautiful daughter, the inspiration was there. You know, she was so young when I adopted her. Oh. And despite what she's gone through, she's always seen the world with such kindness and joy. She's the light mm. of my life. And it makes me so happy to share that light with our community. She really is something special. Watching her perform is simply delightful. I mean, the whole show is just so cute. Thank you, Sadie. Do you see big things happening with Amanda the Adventurer? I've actually had some people approach me about it. They want to turn Amanda into a cartoon. I can't really talk about Wait. it yet, but it's exciting. It feels like a dream, the idea of welcoming even more kids into this wild, mm. creative world. It feels like my little show could really have a big impact. That's incredible. <laughs> Sam, thanks so much for having a coffee break with me today. Our community is so lucky to have you. And Rebecca. On our next coffee break, it's getting interesting floral now. arrangements for all occasions. Featuring the so newest now, addition yeah, to our neighborhood, to Rose Matthews of Rose's Bouquet. Rose Matthews. Until then, may your coffee always be steaming and the conversation sparkling. There's a little bit more lore for us. Now, I'm going to give my thoughts after we've watched all the tapes. This is getting very interesting. Let's see if there's anything else hidden here, though. Yeah, they're totally talking about something right now, huh? That's all for show. We know they weren't talking about anything. All right, so uh, that was interesting. Let's uh, let's get them some more tapes. That Wait, the doll is gone. All right, whatever. We still have this growing, though. I don't know. I hope I'm doing this right, though. It's going to be a pain if I have to restart the game to grow that thing all over again. But all right, let's get the next tape. All right, guys, the next tape is finally here. So for this one, we have to get here. I, I cannot you know, obviously leave this. Um, we have to get to this part right here. But instead of going through that and getting butchered by Amanda, we need to grab this flower and hope that this Thank works. You. Oh, That's I got it. Favorite flower. No problem. I got a surprise for you, but you you'll do. have to turn around. What is it? Peekaboo. There's another tape, I guess. Wait, where? I don't, oh, she's holding it. There we go. We got the next tape. All right, let's give this a wa wait. I can't watch it yet. Oh, my, I have to get butchered first. You're kidding me, dude. All right, fine. Let's go get uh, attacked by this guy. Got to do what you got to do. And uh, let's quickly get out of this so I can watch the tape again. But check this out. It's always a cool ending to me. End up as just like a pile of meat. We're like one of the little piles of meat with eyes on it, which is kind of weird. That means that those are all like different people that have watched the tapes. All right, so let's go and press continue, though. And hop back in. It's unfortunate I had to restart my whole game to do this, though. It's taken me about an hour to get all these so far. So it's definitely not an easy process. All right, so there's the purple tape. It looks like we only need one more. One more tape. This is exciting. Let's watch this, though. Let's see what happens. Here we go. It's going to be exciting. Ooh, where are we? What the heck? What's that say? Rebecca, that was great. Let's move on to the next one. Bye, uh, yeah. Pie What? Pie man. Pie man. Pie man. What's going on? Pie lamb. Pie lamb. What is this? What is she reading? Just a few simple words. Uh, this script is specifically tuned to train the technology's dynamic voice reaction. The what? I want this to stop. <sighs> Sam, why don't you take a walk for a few minutes? We've only got a few more of these. No, the I don't want to do that. What are they Rebecca, having a read? What's wrong? Who are you talking to? The man in the headphones. Oh. There's no man. She's upset. This is going too far. Let's just take five. Rebecca, come on out and go. We'll... So wait, was the company that's making the cartoon? Yeah, they they are tricking Sam. And Rebecca. They're like trying to brainwash her or something, but that's interesting. Okay, so for the final tape though, we need to type a specific code into this robot. If you guys remember, we actually got that code in our playthrough and I didn't have the chance to type it in because we ended up beating the game and I forgot all about it. But if we type it into this robot, which obviously we can now go over here, we need the scissors. So you need to go over here, uh, type in guts. You can type this in at like any point in the game, which is kind of cool. Um, we just got to go over here, type in guts. So let's go ahead and quickly put this in. G-U-T, and then S is right here. 
We need the scissors, obviously, to get the batteries from the doll's head. And then we need to turn that robot on and get what is uh, inside of it, which is apparently the last tape. Which I'm excited to get all these tapes, though, because from what I heard, it gives us a new ending. Which, ooh, I can't wait. Alright, so there's the batteries. Oh my, dude, that scream is so loud. Did I get the batteries? No, there they are. Alright, let's go ahead and put these into the robot. Okay, or drop them on the side of it. That works too. Alright, those are in. And let's go ahead and get this code and type it in. Okay, so the code is 401258. Here we go. Let's see what it says. The treasure's in the chest. It's what's on. It's on the inside of it's what's on the inside. Okay, so he's got the key. We need the key to the chest, though, right here, which we've opened this before. So wait, do I just get the normal ending now, and then it gives me the tape, or how does this work? Here we are at the ending, so I'm going to put in the code 28... I think it's 2862, but I could be wrong. And yep, we're in. So we're gonna get the ending, the ending like normal, and see if anything new happens here. So we're gonna fill up the bucket with water, of course, which uh, I don't remember. Okay, come on, put that there. There we go. Let's get that going. Let's grab this tape and give it a watch so we can continue and get the ending here. All right, so home movie. Oh, I got an achievement! Splish splash. Four, oh, this is new. Two, five, okay, four zero one two five eight. Don't have much time. Okay, so four zero one two five eight. Hold on, let's type that in first. Uh, let's quickly do this just to make sure we're doing it right. Four zero. Zero. One, two, four, oh, one, two, five, eight, go. Okay, so there we go. Yep, it's what's inside. Yep, it's, all, it's what's on the inside. Okay, so we know this is normal. Let's continue to watch the tape here. Hold on, let's continue to watch the tape. Okay, go. We don't have much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's quickly get this out of the way. Okay, so that's done. Now, so he's done. Now we need to continue and get the ending, though. Let's take the bucket of water. Let's throw it on him. So he has now been destroyed. Yep, please do not. So everything so far seems the same, though, besides him obviously saying what he just said, but please do not forget me. I won't forget you, little buddy, all right? But sorry, you gotta go. All right, there's the key. Let's get the final tape and beat the game. I'm excited, though. I'm hoping we get something new. The fact that I just got an achievement, though, back there means that this is, this is gonna be something new. Because so far, we haven't seen anything else. So, I'm excited. All right, here we go. Tape's in. Let's watch it like normal. Let's see if anything changes, though, while we're watching it. Because obviously, I think the final tape, so... Let's see what happens here. Okay, so, so far, it looks the same. She's singing, though. Hi! I'm... Amanda. Mm. When you're friends, you can share all kinds of things with each other. I can share my crayon. crayons with you, so you can have fun coloring, too. Oh, sure. Look at silly Mr. Fox. Yeah, well, you remember him. Sharing shows you care about someone. How about you share Friends some new secrets, Amanda, toys. huh? <laughs> they can share snacks. Oh, yeah. Cool. I'll share some of my snacks with you. Which snack would you like? Um, this is the only one we, we selected these two. Let's like the burger. Yum, that's my that's what that favorite. Is. Or mushroom. Friends okay. can share other things too. Seems normal they though so far. They can share secrets. Ooh, secrets. Can I share a secret with you? Yes, yes, yes. Are you sure? Yes. It's a big. Yes, secret. I'm sure. Yes. Is it really okay? Yes, to share my <laughs> it's okay to share a secret. With you? Share the secret, please. I'm out there. Oh my. Somewhere. What if we pause? Um, oh my gosh. Whoa. Okay, so remember this. Okay, so, so far this is the same. We gotta grab the brick. Grab the brick, yep. Throw it at the TV like normal. Wait, can I look around? No, it's the same. I wonder if we don't destroy the TV, what happens, but let's throw it. Boom. And... So far this is normal. There's gotta be something new, dude. There's gotta be. It's turning daytime. Come on. Show me something. There's, oh. Oh, a new person! I got an achievement! The end! That was somebody in, like, a raincoat. They didn't have a face, though, right? I'm gonna have to go back and pause, but that, that they did not look like they had a face there. So we, we did it. That's the secret ending. I got the achievement, too. So hold on, hold on. You guys can see on screen now I have the achievements up, though. I got all of them. Yep. So the achievement is called The End, question mark. And it says dot, 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 and a new friend. 
and it's a guy with like a hat on and he's standing in front of the sun. So, oh man, we did it! That's every achievement in the game. We 100% completed it. It took me about almost two hours to get that ending, but we did it. It took a while, but that was worth it, man. All right, so, ooh. all right, let's break down what happened in these tapes, though. Going off of what we've seen in the tapes, this is basically what happened, but I could be completely wrong. Let me know in the comment section. But Sam created a show called The Man of the Adventurer. He got contacted by a big, large company that wanted to make it into an animated series, which is what we were just watching, and things went horribly wrong. Sam ended up going missing, which I'm assuming it's because of this company that bought the show or whatever and wanted to make it into an animated series. They started training Rebecca, which is a man or uh, Sam's adopted daughter, and training her to say some weird things. I don't know if it was like some kind of curse or... I don't know what that whole part of was, or whole, whole part was with that tape where they had her like saying like random words over and over again, but they were trying to like trick her into saying something. Sam wasn't having it. They knew Sam wasn't a fan of it. So I think they got rid of Sam and uh, that's when things started going bad. The show started getting stranger and stranger. People started reporting, you know, weird things that the show was saying, like to not listen to your parents and stuff like that. So then the show kind of got, you know, canceled in a way or boycotted, whatever you want to call it. And uh, now we found the tapes and it looks like we're kind of like figuring out what happened here. I don't know who we're playing as though. If you guys know, comment down below. But whoever we're playing as is trying to figure out what happened in these shows. Like what, what, what happened in, what, what happened with Sam basically? What happened with Rebecca? Even though it seems like Rebecca has turned into Amanda, and uh, we don't know who her real dad is, though, because obviously she was adopted. So someone's investigating it, though, too, which is very interesting. Because, look, we got another uh, another uh, little sticker right there, which who we saw at the end, though, he, he must have been an investigator because he had, like, the top hat on. He had the trench coat. So he's trying to figure out what's going on here, which this could be Sam. We don't know what happened to him, but I don't know. Someone's trying to figure out what's going on and uh, piece things together. So we won't really know more, though, until we get, like, either a DLC or a second game. But, or, you know, we find more secrets or stuff that I missed. So let me know in the comment section down below if I missed anything. That seemed to be what's going on here. And, uh, yeah, I'm excited for the next game, though, or whatever they do next. I definitely want to know more and, and see what's going on here with this cursed TV show. So, anyways, that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, leave a like on the video down below. Show this video a ton of support. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out.